actor who Sheridan believes the Australian film industry is in a debilitating rut, hamstrung by an inherent fear of trying something new and a constant need to replicate successes of the past. The Pact to the Rafters and House Husband star, who splits his time between Australia and the US and just finished shooting local war drama movie Escape and Evasion in Queensland, said filmmakers had to take bold chances and tell stories that made us uncomfortable. Certainly for a very long time, Australia's always been a very politically correct country and we like things to be pleasant, and we don't always tackle harder stories, but I think in order for the industry to flourish, we have to, he said. The glory days of Australian film delivered a number of quintessentially Australian stories that were celebrated on the global stage, but it also set in place an unhealthy obsession, he said. I feel like years ago we went through an amazing period of film where we did take the piss a lot, they were heartfelt stories like Muriel's Wedding or Priscilla or Strictly Ballroom, Sheridan said. That was a very successful period and I feel like ever since then we've just been trying to recreate it. Producers have to throw money into big budget films that don't play up to the stereotypical Aussie lyricing, he said. The industry should be investing in stories like The Post, Sheridan said of last year's film about the Washington Post's investigation into the ongoing cover-up of US involvement in the Vietnam War. I was so blown away, what a horrible thing, a horrible part of US history. It happened, thousands of people died, but they are like back quote let's talk about it, let's try and educate people. We need to be making more films about Australians on a blockbuster level," he added.